music for Lagos. 102.3 Max FM. You're listening to Entertainment Street on the Max Breakfast with Debbie and Adriel. It's time for us to take you around and tell us, tell you what is buzzing. You can actually join the conversation on my Instagram live as well at Debs Extra, D E B S E X T R A. And I like uh, what uh, Adriel is putting on this morning. He's wearing one tropical up and down. I don't know whether he's going for a date after the show, but uh, yeah. It's personal. <laughs> it's personal. <laughs> All right. What is buzzing on the internet? And on All right. The he's uh, right here on Entertainment Street. I, I, the first person will jam on Spyro. And uh, what he's saying right here, he is saying that his mission is to influence the music industry for mm. God. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> for God. All right. He said that is his mission. And of course, uh, he reviewed why he doesn't use dirty lyrics in his songs. He reviewed why he does not like um, female coming out to Dancing shake against you, against you. what mama gave them. So wait, how would you classify who who is your guy? That, that's like... Uh, so you can actually sing it in church? Who's your guy? Yeah, can you sing it in church? Uh, I'm just as you say singing the church. The first thing that came to my mind is him. So okay. imagine when you want to sing, who is your guy? Using him, so you say, who who's your guy? Your guy? Wow, wow. Now only me. Please never ever <laughs> attempt to join the choir. Who told because you? They see, will, in fact, see, instantly they will I, throw you out. I am an ex choir master. Don't play with me. <laughs> Which of the choirs? Eh? <laughs> If I call the shots now, you'll be shocked. Uh, in fact, I'm, I'm, I'm too shocked. Well, that's not the only thing trending. Mm. Yesterday, um, Caroline, should I say Hutchins slash Danjima? Mm. She was um, on, a, on a particular podcast, I believe. And she gave, you know, um, so many uh, uh, things that have been going on in her life. She talked about so many yeah. things happening to her. Yeah. But a lot of people, obviously, were so interested in her status, her marital status. What yeah. exactly is going on? Is she still mm. married to Danjima? I mean, Musa Danjima, her former husband. I mean, her... Uh, should I say estranged husband? Are they together? Officially divorced? What's mm. happening? Well, she said they are they are officially divorced. I like I just like this. But uh-huh. divorce is just a paper. But of course, that is what it is. And she said her ex husband is still the love of her life. Mm. See, eh? people always think say maybe after divorce, then you don't turn re enemy mm. with the person that you used to love. Mm. No, when things and things should end beautifully. You get? I mean. You don't want it anymore. You guys end it. But of course, enmity uh, among the two of you, I think, is, is immaturity. <laughs> so uh, this, this what he said here is really, really mature. She so, she so, came out booty to say that the her uh, ex-husband is still the love of her life. So looking at the response of people, some people are wondering if the ex-husband was not a danjima and didn't have money, would she still feel the same way? You pull, you pull this have you well, we cannot we can we cannot categorically say anything thing. about it. We can only wish them well. Mm. <laughs> but divorce is just a paper, whether you just like people. it or it's but just then, a paper. But then but then if, if, I mean, you I mean, old fire would any light pass. Yeah, I want to ask a question. If you're dating someone and the person says, mm. Oh, I used to be married and my former husband was the love of my life, mm. how would you feel as a guy that's trying to ask her out? A former husband the love of is the love of her life. But you're asking she's she's divorced now. Yes. She's now, single she's on uh, so me to prove myself now okay so that i'll sweep her off her feet okay she will look at me and say oh you i thought she will not say i, I thought th- my ex-husband was the love of my life now, now i now understand you know, what love means you are, you are, you are the definition the of love you are now the light you are the you are the you are you are my inner light okay <laughs> all right there you oh, go okay, <laughs> man. Good music for lagos 102.3 max fm or an entertainment street mm. and uh <laughs> our second name is Toknadu. yes so that is when we say a thing we do it we do it <laughs> Oh. Well, Lua Kemi says, love you guys. Thank mm. you so much. Also, my Instagram live, Debs Extra. Mm. Ui Harry says, Caroline owns an oil and gas, gas business. Okay. Whether she go, got what? it through this him is, or not, a, this is honestly, my, happy for her. This though. is my issue with us. Mm. Everything must not be about money. About money. Eh? Love comes. You, you know, and love is important. Mm. So, so, and it's, and it's, so people are saying it's because she's rich or because the ex-husband is rich. No! She has just expressed as even if she's poor, mm-hmm. a poor man, a poor, mm-hmm. a poor, mm-hmm. uh, someone that doesn't have money, mm-hmm. a female or a male, can also fall in love. I can mm-hmm. tell you that you see, my ex's man is the love of my life. But but but, but, we... but the story or the gist again is mm. the guy seems to have moved on, remarried. Mm. So is she going to be dragging position with the woman by saying? Did she tell you people that she's I'm going just, back? That's a question. Will she be dragging? Is a question. I'm no, saying, the way you are asking me is. Will she be dragging? Is the question. If you don't have an answer, let's begin. And that's what I'm saying now. Did she tell anybody that she's going back to the to the man? No, 
no, she only expressed herself okay. that her ex-husband is still the love of her life. Let's leave it at that. I am happy for her. Yes, be happy for her. Go girl. Be happy. Is it good girl? <laughs> <laughs> women supporting women. That's good. <laughs> All right, I'm seeing this one here. This one is coming from singer Joe Boy. Joe boy the deck. I bet it that is it. Joe boy pond deck. Joe boy pond deck. I say Joe boy the deck. Uh, Joe boy the deck. For me, your life. For you, in what? That's why you go outside and grab my microphone. Joe boy the deck. Joe boy the deck. If, if the guy if he deck you like yeah, that, you know my jokes. You go deck you, Joe boy pond deck. <laughs> 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 All right, uh, I saw him here. He's saying that I was so broke, I had to close my account <laughs> before I made it. <laughs> so he was literally broke. So broke that if they say send your account number, you say I don't have account. You know when your account when your account number. balance is looking like uh, minus, a frequency. No, no, one or two point two is even big. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, ninety one point two. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> What's your account number? You mean Max FM? <laughs> That's crazy. Well, you know, um, but right now he's looking fresh. Yeah, he said but I am one of the biggest thing? artists uh, out of Africa right now. Mm. But there was a time I hit rock button when was this you see i had no money i was so broke i had to close my bank account so let me tell you eh mm-hmm. to every success you see out there mm. there's a story but i also want to you see even me that i'm here oh, no, 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 let okay, me talk okay, even so me that is here mm. you know i remember back in the days when i was broke was so broke but was, look at me now was it max fm frequency look at me now what, what was your frequency no, no i'm just trying to look at me oh, now okay but i want to i'm one of the best thing that has happened to the nigerian media i want to t- <laughs> That's why you're the anointed man. <laughs> well, oh, <God. laughs> I just wanted to add this as well, not mm. to bust anybody's bubble. Mm. A lot of, I, I don't want to tie it to Nigerian artists, yeah. but they tend to have sub stories mm. in the sense of they like to identify with struggle life so, so, so that you can sympathize. And oh, David, this is spinning me that we don't have time. So. You know what I said? So, <laughs> yes. when David started, he said mm. back when I was broke, you mm. and people were like, back when, when you were broke. Where, where? How? Bro, which place? Oh, excuse me, Davido. Uh, see, all of this if you don't talk truth now, which we are. We, all of yeah, where are you? I'm just here to say that all of these artists, don't provoke all us. All of these artists, they always have that moment where they were mm. flat out broke. Eh, no, no, it's mm. a, I think it's, a, it's an African yeah, thing. We used to we 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 used suffer to brag. But the only person I like that has always been honest, eh. always staying 100 is Copy. She as she will never come eh, out no. to tell you when. Copy is on broke. another level. <laughs> but you see, in Nigeria, even Copy might still tell you. In Nigeria, we like see we like glorifying suffering. We make you look like if you never suffer. Then you are not a human being, or you are not successful. Mm-hmm. That's like yeah, somebody would say, if you see, if you see when are they trek, eh? If you see, what the person say, you not try Krishmi, oh. you not try. You are the from a day they go Aja. You see, like that one a small one, a small one. Me not from a I tell they go, I tell they go. Eh, 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 you are not so. You are speaking like it happened. Like how? Obalende no, I'm telling you how Nigerians you try to. to you like, you like taking this personal is the sometimes. Next Olympics, you're you running what? our marathon for us. Wow, <laughs> I was so disappointed, sure. you guys. <laughs> Hit music for Lagos. One hundred two point three Max FM.